Hey YouTube, this is Game Boy Geek 947 Um, today I thought I'd show you guys Windows Calendar, which is right here, Windows Calendar. Um, it's basically a calendar program, a little bit like m the Mac OS, the iCal, iCal, like um, Mac OS X, like OS X has or Mac OS X has. Um, it's a little different. They made it very, um, very unique. I think Microsoft made it very unique. Um, like they show you what the date is. I think Vista shows that. I think OS 10 shows that too, but they didn't. But, um, so yeah, let me show you guys how it works. So, like, let's say you need to go, and let's say you just want to do something. So, you just click right here where it says, right here where it says new appointment. So, I'll click on that. And then it opens up a little paint. It it shows something. So let's just type in Windows Vista Video. And, and then I'll type in slash YouTube. It's our, it's put in there, so basically it thinks, oh wow, and then on the right side it gives you details like um, appointment information, details so like you, like a location. So like let's say you're going on a trip, you can make a whole list of stuff right there. Um, it's really good to use. I mean, or like let's say you have a task to do. Like I mean, this would be excellent for work or something. So like I'm gonna click new task is right next to new appointment. And then the task pane is right there. So like let's type in new ta let's type in a task. So I typed in So on, all right, on the tasks pane, I typed in YouTube video because um, I uh, I've been planning on making a YouTube video. Um, and, um, like, you can delete it, but yeah, select it first. So, I come on, select, um, the Windows System Video slash YouTube thing to say that I'm going to do that today. So, I selected that, and I'm going to click delete. See how that works? I mean, and then, um, if you click on today... And it'll take you to today. Now look at that. It, and if you click view, view, you get day by day by day. It's pretty awesome. And then I click. I think if we click on the down arrow, there's a drop down menu. So basically, you can do day, work week, week, month, work week. Look at that. See, look. Like, that's the, w uh, no, that's not my work week, but it's just the way Vista made it. So, if I click on it again, if I click on it again, I'm going to click on month. And now it shows me the whole month, the whole month of July. Which is pretty cool, I mean, it's awesome. And today is Tuesday the 15th. Um, it says sharing information, which, and, which I don't get. Oh yeah, and on the details panel, let me show you something else. Um, you can like change, you can change, you can change the color of it. So like, let's say you want to make a different color, you can do that. And if you don't like any other colors, you can just go down here to more colors, and then or right here where my um, cursor is, my arrow, um, it shows like the color paint the color window so you can pick different colors like let's do dark red so I just did red so yeah I mean um and it, it also shows that down here you can subscribe to a calendar which I which I'm not done to do 
you can print the calendar, and which I will not do either. Uh, right here shows contacts, my contact, and uh, now my I'm in there. I'm in there, which I don't get. So I'll exit out of that. And then right there is the Windows Calendar Help button. Right here it has like a new appointment, new task, new calendar, or new group. You can import a calendar like a while back. You made a calendar from work. You can import it to your home computer. You can export it, you can print it, um, or you can exit it. You can go to certain dates, um, and all that stuff. You can publish it, you can subscribe to it, you can send it via email or sync it to like a handheld or something. Or Windows mobile device. Now that would be, that, that's pretty cool. So, yeah. Alright, here I'm going to type in a day, hopefully. Now, as you guys can see here, it says search results and zero items because I don't have anything. So, yeah, that's... And if you don't want it there, you can just exit out of it, which is okay. I mean, so, yeah, that's the, my video on the Windows Calendar. Oh, yeah, and I forgot something else. Um, right here on my cursors, you can also make other calendars. So, like, you can say your home calendar. Now it says Brendan's work, Brendan's calendar, because that's my username. And that's, you can set up a home calendar, a work calendar, um... Or let's say a trip calendar for vacations and all that stuff. So yeah, um, so that's my video on the Windows Calendar. Thank you for watching.